The motor or an electric motor is a device that has brought about one of the biggest advancement in the fields of engineering and technology ever since the invention of electricity. A motor is an electromechanical device that converts electrical energy to mechanical energy. The primary classification of electrical motor is mainly three types DC motor, AC motor and spatial motor. DC motor and AC motor classifications we will describe in another video and this video link in description below. Spatial motor are four types. 1. Stepper motor. 2. Servo motor. 3. Universal motor. And 4. DC brushless motor. Stepper motor. Stepper motors are DC motors that move in discrete steps. They have multiple coils that are organized in groups called phases. By energizing each phase in sequence, the motor will rotate one step at a time with the computer controlled stepping you can achieve very precise positioning and speed control. Servo motor. A servo motor is a rotary actuator or linear actuator that allows for precise control of angular or linear position, velocity and acceleration. It consists of a switchable motor coupled to a sensor for position feedback. Universal motor. The universal motor is so named because it is a type of electric motor that can operate on AC or DC power. It is a commutated series owned motor where the stator's field coils are connected in a series with the rotor windings through a commentator. It is often referred to as an AC series motor. The universal motor is very similar to a DC series motor in construction, but it is modified slightly to allow the motor to operate properly on AC power. DC brushless motor Brushless DC electric motor also known as electronically commutated motors are synchronous motors that are powered by a DC electric source via an integrated inverter or switching power supply which produces an AC electric signal to drive the motor. In this context AC current doesn't imply a sensor dial waveform but other a bidirectional current with no restriction or waveform. Additional sensors and electronics control the inverter output, amplitude and waveform and frequency. Dear sir, thanks for watching the video. For more update, please subscribe to our channel Learning Engineering and get notification to press the bell icon.